Um, oh my gosh, it's really hot in here. Okay, I just got in my car and turned my car on. So, what I am doing it is the day before my meet tomorrow, and I just got paid, so now I have money to actually go and get some snacks for tomorrow. Oh my gosh, my lips. I feel like my car is really loud, and I'm really sorry, but okay. I put this chapstick on that like makes your lips tingly, so now my lips feel really weird right now. I I don't know where I'm gonna go. I'm debating between like four different places. If I wanna go to Target, Publix, Walmart, Aldi, whatever. I'm gonna get groceries because I need actual food and I'm going to get snacks for after I weigh in tomorrow. Ooh, my lips are burning. This morning and all week, I've been right around 154 pounds, which is 70 kilos, and I'm in the 71 kilo weight class. So that works out perfect. I didn't have to cut any weight, and that works out perfectly because now I can like maybe have a snack or drink some little bit of water before I weigh in. And then later when I get home, I guess I'll show you what I got. And then I'm gonna empty out my gym bag because my gym bag is disgusting. So that is the plan. <laughs> Let me show you what I got. Almond milk, ground turkey. Why did I forget what this was for a second? Celery, little onions, chickpeas, a bang, more chickpeas, Lenny and Larry cookies, coconut water, spinach, and grapes. This, this, and this, okay. These three things are for tomorrow, for after I weigh in. So I have turkey and then I have almond flour to make turkey burgers. And I have black beans because I like to mix the black beans with the turkey burgers. So with the turkey burgers, I'll put some of these onions in and some celery. And then I think there's some peppers in there, like bell peppers. And then um, kind of mix that all together to make a bean burger or a turkey burger. Is this good? Can you see me? I really hope you can see me. If not, I'm really sorry. I have a bowl, a giant bowl, one pound ground turkey. I have one pound, half a white onion, finely chopped. Onions, almond flour, check. A large egg, check. Garlic, fresh basil, I I'm not going back in that cabinet, salt and pepper, uh, black pepper, cool, um, that's it? Like I said, I'm going to kind of make it up as I go because I'm also going to put celery in it and uh, a green pepper. And then I'm also putting the beans in it. So let's just get my stuff in order, okay? Mix everything together, cool. my beans still. I hope this tastes good. I'm always like afraid that whatever I make doesn't taste good because I made some gross things where I put like a lot of effort into something and then it tastes really disgusting. Frijoles! Ooh. I don't remember what I did last time to squish this. I think I started with a fork and then realized that that was taking way too much time. Um, but we're gonna try it again. And I think I ended up using a measuring cup. I probably should have done the beans first. I think that's what I did last time was I squished all the beans first and then I put everything together. I don't know why I was out of breath from that sentence. My arm is already sore. Okay, I'm gonna get the measuring cup out now. Or the, yeah, like, match it. Oh, this sounds gross. Ooh, this works. And I'm over it. This looks so disgusting. A look at it. That looks so gross. So, oh, I almost forgot my little onions. I'm out of breath again. Okay, we're gonna put the egg in. Bloop. And the almond flour. I think it's 
said a fourth cup of marble. A fourth cup? We're gonna go, we're gonna, um, I'm gonna put a half cup in. Half cup of almond flour in. And salt, not a lot because the beans have a lot of salt in them, I think. Garlic. Moving on, let's uh, get them on a pan. So I'm gonna start with this one, and hopefully this is enough. Maybe it will, maybe it won't be. We'll see what happens. I'm trying to figure out how I wanna do this. Let's get some oil. I'm gonna take avocado oil and use that to kind of, can this go high heat? Smoke point of 500 degrees and we are going to 350, so. I'm going to use this to oil up my pan. Hey, now that that is done, I'm going to use this to start with though. As like my guide for how big I want them to be. Yeah, we'll do that. Put this here. I really have no idea what I'm doing. I just hope it tastes okay. That's all I care about. I don't know if I was just recording, but um, I have one ball on here already and now I'm on my second one um this is disgusting oh crap so now let's flatten the balls Top or bottom? I never know which rack to put them on. If I put it on the top or if I put it on the bottom. I burned my burgers. Um, I put them in for 30 minutes and that was obviously too long. And now they're burned. And the oil did nothing because when I tried to flip them, yeah, this happened. That is stuck there. Other than having no flavor, they honestly don't taste that bad. What's that brown stuff? It's a bean. Hmm. I just had a burger. This is kind of like a little like mushier. I thought of nothing else to eat besides a salad. I would eat this instead. That's nice to know. All right, so now we are going to clean my gym bag. Do you think I should just dump the whole thing? No. So we're going to start with the left small pocket. There's probably not the full. Okay. So I have a blender bottle, um, an empty gum container. We can... A contact case that has fluid in it and should probably be cleaned out because there's no contacts in them. So I have this book where I pretty much just write down whatever I'm doing and lifting sometimes. An actual full thing of gum is a portable charger that has a lot of battery on it. I think this pin is broken. Yeah, this pin is broken, okay. And that's it in that pocket because there's a hole in it. Shoes. Lifters, two sets of knee sleeves, Nordic lifting, these are my dad's, the Ray-Bans, uh, Ray-Bans, are they Ray-Bans or Ray-Bans? Aren't Ray-Bans glasses? And those are mine. I have this stuff for my thumbs. Ooh. I have wrist wraps, these are also not mine, those are my dad's, so I should probably give those back to him body spray that is empty. This one is again my dad's, but I use it and he does not. I have a hip circle for warming up and accessory work. Oh, here's the rest of this broken pen. Victoria's Secret Vanilla. This one's my favorite. And that is everything in my gym bag. 
so let me figure out what actually needs to stay in here. So rather than getting rid of this and throwing this away, I am... And I'm gonna put all these little things in there. So we can put a chapstick. So now all these things fit in there. And then I'm gonna put them in there in my gym bag, like this. So that way all the little things can stay together. In a little bit, I'm gonna go do my last little bit of training before my meet tomorrow. When I say training, I mean like I'm gonna grab the bar and just do a little bit of bar work just to kind of get the feel of the movements. And I will just stretch to end my day. Mm -hmm.